Not everything is as clear as it seems, and big companies might use clever logos that are proven to get your attention. From colors that might make you crave certain foods, to mysterious symbols used by the Salvation Army, here are famous logos with secret hidden meanings. Hey guys, if you haven't noticed already, we're almost at a million subscribers, so remember to smash that subscribe button. Number 14. Quicksilver Quicksilver is a sportswear brand that came from Australia originally and grew to be the world's largest brand of surfwear and board sport related gear. Eventually, after various business deals, Quicksilver was bought out by Board Riders Inc., who also owns DC Shoes, Billabong, Von Zipper, and Quicksilver's sister brand, Roxy. So what exactly was the inspiration behind their logo that many people wear while catching a gnarly wave? It actually comes from a piece of woodblock art from Japan that's known as the Great Wave of Kanagawa. It displays Mount Fuji in the background, which is symbolized by the mountain on the logo. Although the Quicksilver version displays much less detail, it helps memorialize this great piece of art. And if you were curious about the Roxy logo, it's really just two Quicksilver logos put together to look like a heart. Number 13. The Beats Logo Here we see the Beats by Dre logo, which just basically looks like a red circle with a lowercase b, but it's a little bit more than that if you look closely. The circle can actually be considered a head, and the lowercase b is in the shape of a circle too. This would leave one to believe that the b is indeed actually headphones, and the red circle is actually someone's head. So the whole time the logo is someone wearing the product, or close enough. Number 12. Alfa Romeo This brand is infamous for creating some of the coolest cars out there, but why exactly is there a snake eating someone? To the left side of the logo, you'll notice the red and white cross, and the right side is the family crest from the Visconti family. The family got this on their crest after defeating a Saracen man during the Crusades. They liked the logo that the Saracen man was holding on his shield and used it for their own family crest. While at first glance, it might look like it's eating the person, but in reality, it's actually the human that's coming out of the snake's mouth. This is considered to be a purifying and renewing process. Whatever the case may be, the logo is meant to represent some pride for the Milanese. Number 11. Toyota Although Alfa Romeo has some cooler vehicles, the Toyota logo is much more recognizable and is actually the sixth largest company in the world based on revenue. They are the second largest manufacturer who produces over 10 million cars per year. Their headquarters is found in Toyota City in Japan and have been around since 1937. So what is it that's so secret about this logo? It appears as though you can spell out the name of the company as you highlight certain parts of it. This diagram here helps explain how this is possible. While it might not be exposing any secrets about the New World Order, you might look at Toyotas just a little bit differently. Number 10. Amazon.com Many of us probably could have never imagined the amount of power and resources Amazon has been able to acquire over the past decade. Amazon's revenue has increased 30% over a year, racking up $232 billion in 2018. In recent times, they've generated more money by recording people and providing streaming services. The Amazon logo has changed quite a bit in the past decade, but the one we see today is most likely the most recognizable. You probably don't even notice too much the little orange arrow that points from A to Z. This is supposed to signify the company's ability to provide you with all kinds of products. Everything from A to Z is basically what they sell, and that's what the name is trying to represent. Number 9. Goodwill You've probably driven by this store before to donate or maybe make a few purchases and seen their logo. They were founded in 1902 and are a $3 billion agency. It's available in 17 different countries too. They've been somewhat criticized for their low wages to employees, while people at the top are receiving well above $1 million a year. Who are you really donating to? The needy or the extremely wealthy? Their logo does look like a smiley face though. You probably never really took too much time to look into this and what it was and figured out that it was just really a half a smiley face, right? Or is it? Yes, while it does look like a smiley face, this is true. Let's take a look at it from a different point of view. Could the smiley face actually be a lowercase g the entire time? You see at the bottom how it's also used to spell goodwill. Well played. Number 8. MGM you might be a little bit curious as to how they get the Metro Goldwyn Mayer movie's lion to growl before each movie. The lion who used to shoot the logo that everyone sees on screen today was named Leo. He would be filmed in his cage with a trainer and a camera person was present. He appears in film since the early 1960s and is still roaring strong in modern times. Leo wasn't the first MGM lion though. That title belongs to Slats, who appeared silently on MGM movies in the 1920s. 
Another notable line used for filming was Jackie, who produced the first audible roar in MGM history for the 1928 flick White Shadows in the South Seas. Number 7. The Colors You Crave Ever notice so many fast food restaurants use the same colors in their logos? Pizza Hut, Burger King, McDonald's, Wendy's, In-N-Out, El Pol Loco all have one thing in common. They all use some shade of yellow and red in their logos. Is there something about these colors that just drive you crazy and absolutely make you crave fast food? The answer is basically yes. There is a reason why they all tend to use these same colors too. Researchers have came to the conclusion that yellow and red tend to be the colors that grab the most attention, increase appetite, make you want to eat faster, and just simply make you crave. They also tend to use these same color schemes inside the restaurants so you can't escape the temptation. In order to keep yourself in check, it's suggested that you just order from the drive-thru and enjoy your meal at home or at a park. Number 6. Wendy's Wendy's was founded by Dave Thomas in the late 1960s in Columbus, Ohio, and is the third largest hamburger producer fast food chain in the world. Wendy's was named after Dave Thomas' fourth child, Melinda Lou Wendy Thomas. Dave Thomas was also a Freemason, but what secrets could this little ginger girl be hiding? If you look close enough at her collar right above the logo, you might be able to see the word mom inscribed. When word got out that the Wendy's logo might be hiding a secret word, the company responded that it was unintentional and people are just seeing things. Other people believe that it was put there to remind them that Wendy's is like old-fashioned cooking when your mom used to cook. What do you believe? Number 5. Baskin Robbins Founded by Burt Baskin and Irv Robbins in Glendale, California in 1945, Baskin Robbins is possibly the largest chain of ice cream in the world with over 7,500 stores worldwide. This famous company sells their product in about 50 other countries across the globe and their logo is well recognized. Could there be a sneaky little secret that their logo is hiding? Baskin Robbins has advertised being able to sell 31 different flavors and you can see that by taking a look at their logo. The B and R are pink and blue, but it's like that for a reason. You can see that 31 is clearly visible in pink, showing off the amount of flavors they got. Beat that, Ben & Jerry's. Number 4. Toplerone During World War I, the French had their own defensive structure called the Maginot Line. So what did the Swiss have? They had the Toplerone Line. It was where they used to play strategic dragon's teeth fortifications with the purpose of preventing tanks from cruising into their neutral little country. The fortifications looked so much like the Swiss chocolate Toplerone that it earned its nickname that way. As another part of their fortifications, the Swiss used an innocent little pink house and fortified it with machine guns. This is called the Villa Rosa and it's an incognito stronghold with fake windows. Normally, when you open the garage, you'd expect to see a car. Here, when you open the garage, you get two big cannons, so watch out. You can also notice there's a little bear in the mountain of the Top of Rome logo, since the Swiss capital of Bern is often referred to as the City of Bears. Number 3. Tostitos Possibly America's favorite brand of tortilla chip is Tostitos, which are heavily advertised during sporting events, and there's even a football game known as the Tostitos Fiesta Bowl. In 1978, the Fritos Lays company decided to do their best to make a chip that had authentic Mexican taste to it. After uncovering some secrets, they launched Tostitos to the public, which then became a huge success. Now there's all kinds of Tostitos you can buy, but you'll notice that they all have a similar logo. In the middle of the word, the T, I, and T come together to form two people placed in a chip into salt. What do those letters spell? Number 2. McDonald's This logo here is seen as being American as apple pie, which they actually sell. Greenpeace accused them of destroying parts of the Amazon rainforest in order to make way for soybean plants to feed the chickens. Protests have broken out about this company's treatment of animals on countless occasions. The CEO is making roughly $16 million in 2016, and that number is expected to grow. They've also been accused of contributing to childhood obesity and even targeting kids to eat their unhealthy food. They're also the largest distributor of toys in the world, and roughly 20% of their sales include a toy. And number 1. The Red Shield You're probably familiar with the Red Shield or the Salvation Army, but what could this logo have to do with the possibility of the most powerful family in the world? The Salvation Army is present in 131 different countries around the world and operates shelters for the homeless and offers relief for people suffering from natural disasters. But could the logo itself have some sinister origin? Keep in mind, if you translate the name Rothschild, Roth means red and shield means shield. The man who founded the Salvation Army was named William Booth. Some like to theorize that Booth was actually a member of the Freemasons and the organization was founded by money through the Rothschilds. As you continue to connect the dots, things get even stranger. Does the last name Booth ring any bells? John Wilkes Booth, possibly? 
Was Abraham Lincoln opposed to the New World Order and assassinated for his beliefs? Maybe the Salvation Army knows a few secrets. Here the two are making the same gesture with their hand partially covered by their coat, often thought to be a Masonic pose. The pose is known as the Hidden Hand of Jabulon, and there aren't any portraits where Lincoln is doing this. Coincidence? What do you believe?